Good day, folks. It's DIY Guy123 here, bringing you another do it yourself video. This part right here is anywhere from 500 to 1,000 bucks. And if you're not wanting to change it yourself, you're, you're probably not getting this replaced for less than a thousand bucks. So for the cost of a $20 tube of sealant, you can get your boat back on, on the water again. I've got this 1991 three liter. This engine was winterized, but for some reason, it must not have been fully winterized because there was some water that gathered in the manifold. I guess maybe it dripped in. I don't know how it got there, but it's there. And it cracked the manifold when the manifold froze. I wanna seal the leak and then I can hook it up to the garden hose then I can run it properly for a long duration, maybe 20 minutes, half hour in the driveway, and I'll do that. And if the crankcase is not taking on any water, mixing with the oil, then I know the block, the engine, everything is good. If the crankcase does take on water, then I'll know the manifold isn't just cracked on the outside, it's got a crack on the inside into the exhaust passages as well. And that means there's nothing that can be done to fix it. It's got to be replaced. So here's the crack right there all along the bottom, this whole edge. Same thing on the inside next to the block. I'm gonna to talk to you about how I clean this up and prepped it to be sealed. I could probably take this off and repair it much easier, but I don't wanna break the gaskets and take the carburetor off and the engine's running as is. Why do I wanna disturb that? I'm using an assortment of die grinders with a 30 grit uh, disc on there, wire wheels. There's an area that I really have to get up and around the corner. So I'm gonna use this to just gently Remove it. The goal there is to clean all the paint off, all the rust off, get down to good metal. Then rinse it with brake cleaner and then blow it dry. And then give it another couple of minutes to really evaporate any of the remaining brake cleaner. Then you're ready to seal it. Or the wire wheel. So here it is all cleaned off the best I can get. And the same on the inside. Ready for sealant. So the product I'm using is the Right Stuff 90 Minute Gasket Maker by Permatex. You can get it in different colors. Black's nice because it blends. This product is designed to never really get hard. It's supposed to be flexible. That's really good in this scenario because the metal will be expanding and contracting as temperature changes. Okay, so my father always taught me do the hardest area first. This is the easiest area and there's the worst. You want it thick. Tube. Way easier. It's important to remember that manifold is not under pressure. All this patch has to do is just basically contain the water till it builds up enough water in here to go up over the exhaust elbow and down. So a couple of psi at the most okay here we are the next day oil's as clean as it should be just shut it off so it's not down on the dipstick yet, but it's not milky at all.